Strath Boys. <laughs> It's good to be on the show with people like uh, uh, Jimmy Davis. I thank the world of him. He's a wonderful man. And I was the first man to ever have him to come to Nashville, Tennessee. And I'm really proud of that. He come up there and played for me one Sunday up there. <laughs> we all got together at the old War Memorial building up there. We, that was it. Over on the left-hand side from the state of Ohio is a fine guitar man and a good singer. His name is Tom Ewan. Would you give him just a little hand? That's enough. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Now with the bass fiddle, a man has been in music for years and years and years. 87 years. 87 years. His name is <laughs> Tater, 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 Spud Tate. Hey. We're up on the right side there now with the five-string banjo. He's from the state of Tennessee, and he's from Sparta, Tennessee. And there they call him the Sparta Flash. His name is Blake William to give him a hand. And the newest member of the Bluegrass Boys is from the state of Michigan. He's way over on the right hand side there with the fiddle. And he's doing a wonderful job with us. And we're glad to have him in the Bluegrass group here. His name is Jimmy Camel. Give him a nice hand. Thank you very much. We appreciate it. And uh, I've got uh, the bug in my throat today. So y'all are going to have to bear with me, I'm afraid. I want to brag on our boss man here. He won a Grammy Award in 89, and he's a member of the Country Music Hall of Fame, and we always enjoy coming to Jekyll Island, Georgia, to play for you. Make welcome the father of bluegrass, Bill Monroe from Kentucky. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, we're ready to start now, and we're going to call on Tom and let him sing for you. And he's got a fine song here entitled, The Old Hometown. <laughs> I'd like to wander back to the old hometown. You never miss the home folks until you've gone away. Then you need a friend to help you every day. And you call on mother, she won't be around. I'd like to wander back to the 
the old hometown Sugar Loaf Mountain. I'd like to sing a couple of songs. I know, I know the words to two songs, so I'll sing them right now and get them out of the way. I just wonder if you remember the first song we want to sing. I'm just going to go ahead and start it, 
and you can let me know. folks here tonight and I wrote it in 1946 and this is Elvis Presley's first song to record and now it's a state song in the state of Kentucky I want you to sing with me on the last half of the song Blue Moon of Kentucky <laughs> Now I want to 
want to play one on the mandolin for you folks here today, and it's entitled Southern Flavor. I think he's getting down. Stage, it's going to come out and join in with the Bluegrass Boys. And for years and years ago, I'd say at least probably 30 years ago, he was a fiddle for fiddler for me, and he was a fine fiddle player. I don't know what he can do now. <laughs> He's got so old and lazy, you know. <laughs> His name is Chubby Wise. Would you give him a hand? Great. This is going to bring back a lot of memories. About 40-something years ago, I rode a few miles with this gentleman right here, and he is the father of bluegrass. Believe me when I tell you, he named him right. 
Bill, it's a pleasure to be able to pick one with you, brother. Well, I'm glad they asked you to come out. Pardon? I'm glad that they asked you and you wasn't you was. Well, I'm glad that you asked that me to you come could out. come out. <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Bill, Here's a number that he played off a good back in the early days, and it's entitled "I Traced Her Little Footprints in the Snow." Yeah. <laughs> Like the summertime, and they can all come out. Strolling through the meadow green, it, but there's no doubt. But give me the wintertime when the snow's on the ground. Or the founder when the snow is on the ground. I traced a little footprints in the snow. I found a little footprints in the snow. Oh, I blessed that happy day that Nanny lost her way. For the founder when the snow is on the ground. Stepped out, but it be returning soon. I found her little footprints and I traced him through the snow. And I found her when the snow lit on the ground. I traced a little footprints in the snow. I found a little footprints in the snow. Lord. I blessed and happy day, and he lost her way. For I found her when the snow lit on the ground. But every time the snow falls, it brings you back memory. For the founder when the snow lit on the ground. I traced a little footprints in the snow. I found a little footprints in the snow. Oh, I blessed that happy day, and he lost her way. For the founder when the snow lit on the ground. Thank you a lot. <laughs> oh, Thank you. the old master. <laughs> Traveling you, down that long road. You just knew one song, didn't you? I'd did, like to do just did, one did, more, oh, would you? Oh, you knew one more? I'd like to do, and I believe if I remember right, Bill. Well, quit working your mouth. Uh, if my memory serves me correctly. You're I'm shaking sorry, things this is the last tune I believe I recorded with the bluegrass boys. <laughs> <laughs> one called Traveling Down That Lonesome Road, Traveling Bill. Lonesome you would remember road. that. Kill that, isn't it?
All I do is roam around and look for you, my dear. I know I've searched ten thousand miles for how I need you here. You broke my heart, you let me in, and now I'm going home. Why did you go and leave me there to travel this lonesome road? I'm traveling down this lonesome road, oh, how I hate to go. Did you come out and played a couple with us? Thank you, Bill. I enjoyed it. Certainly did. Back in the early days, so you wouldn't be no chubby wise if it hadn't been bluegrass music. That's right, Bill. I well, agree you. there Thank 100%. You. Bill Monroe, gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, fellas. Yes, sir. Sir. Yes, sir. Enjoyed it. Yes, sir. Quartet. Now the bluegrass quartet's going to sing a few folks here today. I'm working on a building. I wrote a lot of fiddle number down through the years. 
And this number's entitled Old Dangerfield. I'd also like to say that uh, this fiddle I'm playing here is uh, compliments of uh, Joe Young. I'm playing his fiddle tonight, and it's one that he just made and just finished it about three weeks ago. So, so here it is. <laughs> Thank you. 
All right. Now we have a number coming up here that I'm really proud of. This is another number that I wrote a long time ago. And uh, this is about my Uncle Ben Vannevar on my mother's side of the family. And he was the first man I ever heard play a fiddle back when I was just a small boy. He used to come and visit us on the weekend and sit around the far place after our mother would have supper for us. We'd sit around the far place and Uncle Ben would take the fiddle out and fiddle for us. And he passed away in 1932. I wrote this number called Uncle Ben. <laughs> Come from far away to dance all night till the break of day. You when they called her a holler, oh she know you knew Uncle Pin was ready to go. Uncle Pin played a fiddle, Lord, how it rang! You'd have to talk, you'd hear it sing. He called Soldier Joy and the one he called Boston Boy. The greatest of all was Denny Land, but that's where Philly began. Denny and the Bats and Lord Hard and Hill and Uncle Ben played the fiddle, Lord How it rang. You had to talk, you'd hear it sing. <laughs> That mournful day when Uncle Pink was called away They hung up his fiddle, they hung up his bow They knew every time for him to go That evening in the passion now and hard to feel in the bow Uncle Pink played a fiddle, Lord, how it rang You'd hear it talk, you'd hear it sing Tenbrooks and in the Pines. Can you play into that music valley walls? Run, old mother, run, run, old mother, run. Tinder's gonna beat you to the bright shining sun, to the bright shining sun, oh Lord, to the bright shining sun. Tinder was a big bear horse, run out here, you man. He ran all around me, but he beat the Memphis train. Beat the Memphis train, oh Lord, beat the Memphis train. I see that train coming, it's coming down the curve. See your tin book run up, he's training every nerve. Training every nerve, oh Lord, training every nerve. The women's all a laughing, the children all a crying. It's all a holler, old tin books are flying, old tin books are flying, oh Lord, old tin books are flying. Kiper, Kiper, you are not running right. Mine is a beat, no tin books, clear out of sight, clear out of sight, oh Lord, clear out of sight. Kiper, Kiper. Son, give old Tin Brooks a ride, oh, let no Tin Brooks run. Little Tin Brooks run, oh, Lord, little Tin Brooks run. Oh, 
This is for all the ladies that's here this evening. And I want you to listen to the words and see what the words can really tell you how you should do things way of when you've got a wonderful husband or a boyfriend. And you take care of them right and treat them good. And don't kick them out. Listen to this number here. The old, old house. It's a sad number. tumble down but when the leaf starts to fall in you know oh, 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 the rain starts to drip from the tree there's an old man who walks in the garden and his head is bowed in memory After all, but when the leaf 
you've started to fall And oh, oh, oh no The rain starts to drip from the tree There's a no And his head is bowed in memory Yes, his head is bowed in memory Bill Monroe is going to be having his uh, 25th annual Bean Blossom Festival next year, June 13th through the 16th, and we wanted to remind you to come and be with us up there. And then again in September the 20th through the 22nd. So if you can be with us at Bean Blossom, we'd love to have you. And uh, we'll be out at the uh, tape table in a little while, so come out and visit with us. And uh, we want to do the show for Dale Parton today from North Carolina and uh, Don and Eleanor Reed. And uh, Michelle and Joel Putnam and all of our friends come to the show. We appreciate you all coming out today. We've got some folks here from Texas, too. Do you know that? Tootie Williams. Yes, sir, Tootie Williams. And a, and a beautiful lady. I don't know how he ever got her. but <laughs> yeah. Debbie, but she thinks she knows everything. <laughs> how about the rawhide? There you go. You don't want me to play the rawhide? <laughs> don't just sit out there like that now. We want to go back there and play again for the folks. And we just hope everything will be wonderful for you this year. And I'm looking forward to it. I think it's going to be a great year for us. 
One thing about it, I know this winter's going to be cold. I'm kind of gritting it. Up around Nashville, it's got an awful cold there. But we've enjoyed being with you here, and you folks take good care. And uh, speaking for Blake Williams. Blake. Thank you. Get up to the microphone there. <laughs> Have you enjoyed it? I've had a big time. Jimmy Campbell. Yes, sir, I'm having a big Peter time. Peter Tate. Thank you. Tom Ewan. <laughs> Thank you, Tom. <laughs> Tom, you didn't say nothing. <laughs> Thank you, folks. And for all the Bluegrass boys and everybody that's been on the stage, it's really wonderful to be here with the kind of groups here on this, the show today. It's a wonderful group, fine people, and I'm looking forward to working for you folks here tonight. And speaking for all the Bluegrass boys, we're going to say so long. We'll see you a little later. <laughs> Bill Monroe and the Bluegrass Boys. Back in the days of my childhood, in the evening when everything was still, I used to sit and listen to the fox sound. With my dad in the old Kentucky hills Come on my way back to the old The road wind torn up the hill But there's no light in the window That shine long ago where I live Side and he's going to sing for you folks now. And what have you got picked out this time, Tom? One of your favorites, Bill, Blackjack Davis. That's a good love song for you. You know, you ought to sing that a lot all the time. I think That's I will. just exactly like you, the Blackjack Davis. I think Black I will David. right now. Blackjack Davis. <laughs> Blackjack Davis came right from the woods, sang so loud and gay. Broke the hearts of many poor girls to charm. They charmed the heart of me. How old are you, my pretty little miss? How old are you, my heart? Answered him with a silly smile. I'll be 16 next Sunday. I'll be 16 next Sunday. I'm going to be my pretty little miss. Go with me, my heart. I'll take you where the grass grows green. And you never shall want the money. You never shall want the money.
Last night she slept on a goose feather bed beside her husband and baby. Tonight she sleeps on the cold, cold ground by the side of her blackjack baby. Beside her blackjack baby. Blackjack David came running through the woods, sang so loud and gay. Broke the hearts of many poor girls, and he charmed the heart of a lady. Charmed the heart of a lady. Thanks very much. Thank you, thank you. All right, now we're going to call on Blake, and he's got a number entitled Cross the Cumberland. for this number right here. It's a solo entitled Heavy Traffic Ahead. Down the line and heavy traffic ahead. Heavy traffic ahead. Got a ramble, ramble, heavy traffic ahead. We travel around from state to state. The bluegrass boys are never late. Heavy traffic ahead. Heavy traffic ahead. Got a ramble, ramble. Heavy traffic ahead. With a good will on Friday night, we had far Nashville, heavy traffic ahead, heavy traffic ahead. Got a ramble, ramble, heavy traffic ahead. Got a ramble, ramble, heavy traffic ahead.
Anybody got a request tonight? Ohio. Ohio. <laughs> What? Good my old pal. Texas is the way out west. Oh, Lord, you're a pal, boy, to let him down to rest. I waved him all for his wave to be what it was said. I knew down beneath that mound lay the best pal I ever had. How do they hear yeah, yeah, your new lady?
Now the Bluegrass Quartet is going to sing a few folks here tonight. So, uh, Blake, get up here close and and uh, tell them what you had request for. It's me again. It's me again, Lord. Let us do that. And um, Tater's going to sing bass. Is that right, Tater? Yes, sir. Okay. number for the folks tonight okay. uh, the northern white clouds okay would you do that I wrote this number here and I want you to listen close to it because I think it's a fine number on the fiddle <laughs> Thank you. 
request. Uncle Penn, let us do that one for you. Okay. Bye. 
Uncle Ben played the fiddle on the hound that rang you to hear it talk, you hear it sing. you stray dark as the night I'm blue as the day blue as the sky there's blues in my heart it's dark outside since we've been apart oh tell me please tell me what made you stray, dark as the night, and blue as the day? you stray dark as the night I'm blue as the day thank you very much we uh, we appreciate you being so kind to us and uh, it wouldn't be New Year's without coming to to Jekyll Island and uh, if I could get this bug out of my throat, I'd be a whole lot happier, I tell you. Appreciate you coming by the record table today, and we'd love to have you at the Grand Ole Opry sometime this winter when uh, business is a little slow. You can get tickets about any time up there right now. And uh, remember us at Bean Blossom, Indiana in June, the 13th through the 16th. We'd love to have you for that, and uh, appreciate you coming by. We're going to try to do some more requests for you, so get those ready, and uh, we'll do the best we can for you. Here's a song that a gentleman asked for that I wrote, and I'm uh, pleased to be able to do it. And thanks again, everybody, for uh, your support out at the record table. It's, an, it's about my home state. I hope you'll like it. It's called Ohio. Jimmy, let her go. <laughs> we'll get to Jimmy. I've traveled around from state to state to other lands I've been. There's no place in this old world like the Buckeye State, my friend. Where peaceful farmland stretches out as far as the eye can see. From the hills in the south to the lake up north, it's home, sweet home to me. Oh, how I'm heading home to you. The road to Columbus 
will carry me through the sweetest country in the land that's proud long to go cause there's nowhere that can compare with ooh hi Kentucky's mighty fine, home of Bill Monroe. And West Virginia's wonderful and wild, I know you know. Lots of folks, they love to live in sunny Tennessee. But put me in Ohio, boys, that's where I'd rather be. Ohio, I'm heading home to you. The road to Columbus will carry me through. Say they've missed me so And the kindest friends that's ever been on live in Ohio Ohio, I'm heading home for you The road to Columbus will carry me through The sweetest country in the land That's where I long to go Cause there's no Job with it right there. Sound good. Days gone by. You know that man? Yes. How, how do we do that? Days gone by. In Asheville, North Carolina, many of my Sweet our love was together. Sometimes it makes me cry.
my loved ones together Sometimes it makes me cry
little water boy. Why don't you bring that water around? If you don't like your job, sit at water. Thank you. We appreciate that, and uh, you've been very kind to us tonight. Uh, reminder, we're going to be on uh, Nashville now January 15th, so y'all uh, tune us in for that. And uh, if we get around your part of the country, be sure and come out and see us. We'd love to have you. And uh, I know we haven't got to all the requests tonight, but uh, we've tried, and we appreciate y'all bearing with us on some we hadn't tried in a while. And thank you for being so kind to us, okay? Back when I played for President Bush out in Houston, Texas, he gave me this pin right here, and it's about all the foreign countries you know that he had out there. And so he gave me that pin right there to keep. And over on the left-hand side right here, this little one right here, is 50 years on the Grand Ole Opry. Right down here is the state of Kentucky where I was born and raised, so I put that up there too. But I just want to tell you that. But I've enjoyed it here, and I, I want to come back. And, and uh, Norman Adams is a books this year and takes care of everything, and he's a wonderful man. He's just a good friend of ours, and I appreciate it, and I like to work for him. And uh, so we want to come back, and you folks uh, take care and see that we do come back. We, we want to come and play for you again. <laughs> and I want to wish you all the best. Take good care of yourself, and I hope you all had a good Christmas, and you will have a wonderful New Year. Speaking for the Bluegrass Boys, and yours truly, we want to say good night to you all, and we love you. <laughs> Bill Monroe and the Bluegrass Boys. <laughs>